Hello and welcome to another SEO science video. Today we're talking about something very exciting. The result of our first community SEO experiment. Each month we host a competition that all SEOs can get involved with, even you. The task is simple. Submit the details and results of your SEO experiment and we'll see who's achieved the best results. The winner gets a pretty smart trophy, as well as a gift voucher, plus the title of winner. It's completely free to enter, so you've got no excuses not to get involved. And today's winning experiment is an interesting one. It's super simple, anyone can do it, and I could see you get results pretty much straight away. So let's take a look. We're delighted to welcome SEO analyst Richie Billing, who has won this month's competition. So, Richie, welcome. Thank you very much for having me. You are more than welcome. So tell us about uh, your experiment. Yeah, it's uh, it was quite an interesting one. Got really good results um, within a very short space of time as well. And in short, uh, all I was doing is updating poorly performing pages and um, changing the publication date when I'm finished, um, which seems really simple. There's a little bit more to it, but it works. That's the main thing. <laughs> Fantastic. So a good place to start is the results of the experiment. Uh, would you like to tell us what happened? Yeah, of course. So um, my website is all about creative writing. So it's in the education niche, which is a bit competitive. Uh, and I had a page about writing dialogue in stories, which was doing pretty average. It wasn't ranking in the top 10 for pretty much anything. Um, it did have a few keywords um, attached to it. So I think there was 79 keywords ranked for at the start of this experiment, as you can see on the graph, um, with the vast majority not ranking anywhere near the top 10. So it's basically, it's, it's okay, it's getting keywords, but it's not getting any traffic. So it's a bit of a waste of time. Um, it was also wasn't adding, uh, getting any new keywords, it was just losing them. So that, that was a bit of a, a worrying sign. Um, so I just gave the page a bit of a revamp. Um, I'll tell you what, exactly what I did next. Um, but within the space of about five weeks, um, the uh, page went from 79 total keywords to 219, which is a pretty big jump. Um, and most keywords, um, they haven't moved into the top 10 yet. Um, but because it's only been five weeks, I'd expect it to be um, around this stage now anyway. And probably in another four or five weeks, then it'll hopefully have a few more in the top three and it'll be getting more traffic. So when you update content on your site, which is a very effective um, and easy way to boost your traffic, um, it usually refreshes in your sitemap. So if you look at your sitemap, you'll see the updated page is at the very bottom because it's just being updated. But when um, Google crawls your sitemaps, I found that sometimes it just wouldn't really pay much attention to all the hard work that you've put onto your, your page. So. Um, I did a bit of digging and I saw a really great guide on Ahrefs and one small point in that guide was about changing the publication date um, when you finished updating the page and there was no clear reason given why you should do this but I assume it's got something to do with the metadata on the page. Uh, I might be wrong but based on the results of this experiment I think there has got to be some kind of bit of code in there that Google reads um, because it really does work when you just do this simple thing. Um, so just to talk, talk you through how I update the page because that is really important because you can't just change the publication date and expect everything to just work. You've got to do quite a bit, uh, a few steps first. So um, if, you're, if you've already got content on your site that you want to improve the rankings of, then I just follow this simple step-by-step -step guide. Um, so first of all, you've got to analyze the page and work out what it's already ranking for. 
and then as you're doing that you can see any opportunities that you could take advantage of and you want to pick out a few keywords to focus on so when you update that page you're going to add them in a bit more and talk a bit more about them um, when you've got your keywords, I always do a bit of um, research on the search intent. So what kind of results come up? Um, take a look at those top ranking pages uh, to see how they've structured their page and the type of headings and the topics that they cover. And usually when you do this, you can identify any content gaps um, in your own um, article or blog post. You can also look for things like videos, infographics, um, images, anything that you think might be giving them an edge in, in the rankings. And then it's just a matter of doing a sweep of your own content and you need to have a look at any sections that you don't think meet the grade or don't really have as much relevance as they used to and just take them out or refresh them, update the content um, and that will improve things massively. Another important step is to find some other pages on your site that are related to the one you're updating. Then you just want to add some internal links from those pages to the updated one. And all this does is share some ranking power and makes it easier for the, the crawlers to navigate your site. And then finally, you can update the publication date of your page. And on WordPress, this is uh, dead simple, you just go to the page and on the right hand panel where it says update, just look for the published on uh, part and click edit. And then you just change the date and time so that was published today. As an extra and an optional step, if you are plugged into Google Search Console, just head on over to that and paste in your URL and ask them to re-index the page. And this just helps speed up the process. And that's basically it. It's uh, six, well, five steps with an optional one at the end. Nice and easy, not too complicated. Um, but it, like I say, gets you good results in a very short space of time. Fantastic, and that's what it's all about, is getting those results in. So, of course, Richie is our SEO experiment winner, and the winner gets this magical trophy. It's not actually magical, it is just a trophy, but still a trophy nonetheless, and it's a trophy well earned. Richie, congratulations. Okay, that's fine. <laughs>